An alleged assault at a local high school has spurred another investigation. A late afternoon confrontation at the school in southwest New Providence has led to yet another probe into an attack against a teacher on a school campus. In this report, Jim Jiminy Swain tells us why the parent taken into custody was later released and where the investigation stands now. Just hours ago, a parent and teacher reportedly got into a heated exchange that landed that parent in custody. Police are looking into an alleged assault on a school campus today. According to police, a teacher and a parent got into a physical altercation on the campus of the Anatole Rogers High School near the end of the school day today. Now, while the parent was taken into custody at the Kamaika Road Police Station, initially we understand that the police are now investigating a counterclaim of assault by the parent against the teacher. And that has meant that the parent was released from custody pending the outcome of the investigation. Now, while Bahamas Union of Teachers President Belinda Wilson acknowledged the incident, she told ZNS News that she was still awaiting the details of the incident from the shop steward. The episode follows an ongoing feud at the Faith Avenue School. The school year began with the Bahamas Union of Teachers calling for the dismissal of the principal. The Education Minister Jerome Fitzgerald has, however, supported the principal, saying that she would remain in her post. This incident comes on the heels of an arrest and subsequent conviction of a parent in Grand Bahama who assaulted a teacher on that island and is now serving time. Jiminita Swain, ZNS Network News.